Hi everyone, my name is Tuduan Alexander and today I am gonna show you guys how to do a translation subtitle. Right here I have a French music video, Le Café, and with English subtitle at the bottom. So what is a subtitle? Subtitles are the textual versions of the dialogue in films, television programs, and video games, usually displayed at the bottom of the screen. And a translation subtitle is the one that translates a language to another language that you can understand and your audience can understand. There are many software to translate subtitle, and the one I am using right now is Subpro 3.2. The great thing about Subpro 3.2 is it's free. You can get it from using Google, and it's really lightweight, 294 kilobyte. Okay, let's open Subpro 3.2. As you see here, we have subtitle A and subtitle B. Subtitle A is the, the original subtitle, and the B is the one for translation. We have six column here. The first column is the number, which shows the number of line. The start time is when the conversation gonna start, and the end time is when the con conversation gonna end. And the duration is how long it takes from the start time to the end time. And the subtitle A in here is the dialogue. It's gonna appear in the box on the left side at the bottom. And subtitle B is the translation, translation, and it's gonna appear on the right box at the bottom. Let's click on subtitle A. As you see here, I am doing the movie weekend and it has subtitle A which is in English let's uh, click on it oh one thing I almost forgot to mention there are six types to six types of format of subtitle dot srt dot smi dot ass dot ssa dot uh, tst and dot mkv let's open the, ori the original subtitle And uh, at the bottom, you can see there are many uh, bu uh, buttons, but the most important is the translation mode because it's gonna play the movie. So you know when is the conversation gonna start, and it helps you to see the time, so they they are seen correctly. <coughs> Yeah. Right here, I am in uh, the fourth conversation. It starts in the two minute mark. And as you see here, the, the subtitle A appears on the left box. And on the right box is the one I am gonna tie down uh, whatever in subtitle A. And I want to translate it to subtitle B. Um, to control um, the translation, you use the arrow. To say like I have two lines right here. I use arrow down to go down, and arrow up to go up. Left to go to the left, and right to to the right, and enter to make a, a space to go to the next uh, paragraph. And when I want to see whether it's seen with the movie, I use the command press down alternate and combine with the arrow say like I use arrow alternate and arrow up it's gonna to go to the third line and when I go I use alternate and down arrow it's gonna go to the below uh, line 4 and I use alternate right arrow it's gonna play the movie at the 2 minute mark of the conversation and alternate left arrow is gonna force the movie say like if I want to go to the line 10 at the 2 minute mark and 30 seconds I press down alternate and 
just press arrow down until I go to the line I want and then press alternate and right arrow and it's gonna start to play the movie in the 10 minutes mark let's click on the subtitle B and you see here uh, because I already did it uh, last weekend so everything is already in place one thing you need to remember that the select source in here because there are many languages and not every language is the same it's not really important for English because it's kind of standard but for other languages such as Russian, French, German or especially Asian language they use different uh, phone codes phone format code like for Vietnamese uh, it's used Unicode for, for the phone and after you have done uh, everything click on save to save your work now and it's really important that it need to be the same name as the movie yes okay let's close and see whether it work you see here is a list of title and let's change to the one we just did just now thank you for watching and I hope um, my video is helpful to you guys bye bye